orange and blue taking on the red and gold in the preseason. A live look out at Sports Authority Field at Mile High where the Broncos' first home game against the 49ers is just wrapping up. And getting into tonight's game was a little different for fans. New security measures were used for the first time tonight at Sports Authority Field. No more pat-downs and searches. Now there are metal detectors. 7 News reporter Kyle Horan is live at Mile High. And Kyle, first time with fans. How'd it go out there? Well, the short answer is it wasn't a catastrophe. Some people like the 93 metal detectors they had at all the entrances, while others didn't like the long lines. But in the end, it didn't ruin anybody's day. Most Broncos game days start off like this. With some parking lot fun. We are ready! We're the official owners of this spot. And it was bequeathed to us by Tim McKern and the Barrel Man, and we would not miss a game for anything. For first timers and veterans. We've been season ticket holders for seven years now. Um, it's the first year this truck's been here, though. Broncos game day is usually a good day. It's been a lot of crazy stuff going on in the world, so anything they can do to keep us safer and fine with. What's new here are these metal detectors at every entrance, and as more people arrive, the lines grow. Wait, ten minutes probably. Yeah, ten minutes. Dan Hoffer timed how long it took him to get inside. He got here early. Six minutes, forty-five seconds. Anytime you have a human doing metal detector, you always have that chance of maybe not getting everything checked. Here you're going through, and if you beep, you know you got to go back through, or they'll wad you down. But for latecomers, thank you for your understanding and cooperation with this policy. I worked at the old stadium and this stadium. These crowds are a little bit backed up today. It can be a little frustrating. They do sing long, don't they? They're clear down the stairs. Lines did stretch, but at 7:10, almost everyone was inside. Hopefully, they get it all worked out so that it'll be a little quicker. Now, we did see that four of those metal detectors were not working today. However, staff here at the stadium say they think it's going to be a little bit more efficient as the time goes on. Reporting live outside Sports Authority Field, I'm Kyle Horan for 7 News.